know at this time of year there's a lot of songs about Christmas, but there's not that many songs about what we consider the much more important festival of the year. So this is a song for folks like you and us. Get out a haggis, hey, it's time for Hogmanay. Of December it's the last day, let's celebrate Hogmanay. Hogmanay is the start of the new year. It's when we have a big party with whiskey, haggis and beer. But if you feel like the only kid who has to sing old Lang Syne, here's a list of folks who are Scots just like yours and mine. David Tennant goes first footing around the houses. Alan Cumming sings, Donald, where's your trousers? Guess who eats tatty dogs, mealy pudding and neeps? Why, only the Sinkoli brothers, Sanjeev and Hardeep. Actually, they probably don't eat the pork-based bits of that. You don't need good King Wenceslas giving fuel to some old beggar when you can compare kilt pins with Bobby Carlyle and Ewan McGregor. So get out a haggis, hey, here comes Hogmanay. John Barrowman, the singing gay, he also does Hogmanay. Gordon Ramsay's Scottish, if you didn't see. Sally Magnuson's part of a Scottish dynasty. There's that lassie out of Texas. Kirsty's walking young, and I know, our greatest living artist, and also Jack Vetriano. Rod Stewart, not strictly a Scot. Scotty out of Star Trek, groundsman William Shrek, also not. But one half of How Clean's Your House, that one that does the dusting, is Scottish, and so's Nicky Campbell, Kelvin McKenzie, and Colin and Justin. So many Scots are poets, writers and singers, yet we cannot teach the rest of the country how to pronounce Mingus. So tell your friends, however many, it's time for Hogmanay. You don't need to spend much money to have a fun at Hogmanay. If you've got hair or you haven't any, it doesn't matter at Hogmanay. Here's a table of mahogany and indulge in monogamy. You can do it on a tobogany. Have a happy, 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 happy Hogmanay.